Hi guys, good morning, happy Thursday. So I went to Walgreens uh, for one last uh, trip before the uh, deals uh, for this weekend because I really want to do the Axe deal as well as I have spent 50, get $10 of uh, Walgreens cash digital booster and I'm going to pair it with spend 40, get $9 uh, Walgreens cash uh, paper booster. Remember I mentioned as much as possible, try to do the deals uh, Sunday through Wednesday because Thursday, sometimes registered reward are no longer printing. And also for the fetch offer, for the axe is expiring. That's why uh, I decided to do it one more last night. And I'm hoping for I bought an offer reset. And yes, it did reset this morning. I also did the big and yes, the register reward is still printing and it's also giving $3 of Walgreens cash. So yes, confirm the big is still double dipping as well as the register reward for the Crest and Oral-B still printing last night and also the PNG register reward for spending 15. Yes, it's still printing. If you're new to my channel, hi, welcome. Thank you for tuning in on this video. And if you're not subscribers yet, please do consider to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any great deals at Walgreens. And for my returning subscribers, hi, welcome back. And thank you for always watching my videos, for supporting this YouTube channel. I really appreciate all of you guys. And Thank you for all the comments. Yes, I read all the comments uh, and also I'm trying to answer it as soon as uh, possible. I did the axe deal again this is a curbside order because online they are only five dollars each and uh, if you buy three you will receive five dollars of walgreens cash and i use the four dollars and two dollars digital let me show you my receipt as you can see that's the three x fifteen dollars and my four dollars and two dollars digital my total is nine dollars this account only have five dollars so i use a five dollars walgreens cash and pay four dollars out of pocket then I received the $5 Walgreens cash for buying three and I submit my receipt on Fetch. I received 5,000 points. I have offered for the spray 1,500 points each and 1,000 for the stick. But for some reason, it gave me 2,000 for the stick and 1,500 points each for the spray. That's why I received 5,000 points or $5 back on Fetch. So just right there with Fetch, it's already free and one dollar money maker and i checked this uh, morning my ibotha and yes the x offer reset so i submit my receipt on ibotha for four dollars and fifty cents making the three x completely free and five dollars and fifty cents a money maker for me so if you did the x deal multiple times guys check your ibotha because it might reset also and submit your receipt for additional $4.50 for buying three of these apps. I also did the Nivea deal. This uh, Nivea Shave Foam or $3.99, but it's on sale this week, 10% off. So it deducted $0.39. Cents. Also, if you buy two, you will receive $5 of Walgreens cash and we have $2 paper coupon and I also have I bought the offer for $1 each. So for this two Nivea is $7.18, so less $2 a manufacturer coupon, you will pay $5.18, but then you will receive $5 of Walgreens cash and $2 on I bought. Here's my receipt for that transaction. I also use the $5 store register reward and the $2 a manufacturer coupon. My total is 18 cents. Then I received the $5 a Walgreens cash for buying two and I submit my receipt on Ibotha for $2, making that two Nivea completely free and $1.82 a money maker. Then I did my big transaction. So I have spent 50, get $10 Walgreens cash digital booster. I'm also pairing it with spend 40 get $9 of Walgreens cash a paper booster. 
So the first item included in this transaction is the BIC because we have high valued paper coupon as well as digital coupon. So I grabbed three, the other two is $5.43 and the other one is $5.19. If you buy three, you will receive $3 of Walgreens cash, but it's still glitching and it's giving $3 a register reward also if you buy three of this big. I also grab uh, the Cress and Oral-B, $3 each, and we have $1 digital for the Cress and $1 for the Oral-B, and if you buy two, you will receive $4 register reward, making it completely free. I also found this clearance gain $12.49 regular price, but it's on clearance for $9.99. And we have $2 digital coupon making it for $7.99. If you're doing it by itself, it's not a good deal. But because I'm going to pair it with the Oral-B and Crest. So between Gain and Oral-B, I spend $15. So I will receive the additional $5 PNG register reward for spending $15 on PNG products. So making that deal for just $2.99, which is awesome deal. I also did the Nivea deal and uh, this time I added Userin because we have offer on coupons.com. Spend 30 on Userin, you will receive $6 back. So I'm going to work on that deal. Thanks to Miss Jody Dunn because I saw that uh, deal on her account. I forgot about the Userin on coupons.com. So anyway, probably next week I'm going to do more on the Userin or I will do it on CVS because there is a promotion on Userin also. So I grabbed two of the Nivea $8.79 and one of the Userin $9.49. These are regular price items so I'm going to use the 20% discount on regular price item. Total for these three items is $27.07 and the 20% discount will deduct $5.42 that will lead you to pay $21.65. So yes, you will receive the $10 of Walgreens cash for spending $20. I also use $3 paper coupon for the Userin and $2 for the Nivea. After the manufacturer coupon, you will pay $14.65, but then you will receive $10 back, making this uh, three items uh, for just uh, $4.65. But as I mentioned, I'm also using Spend Booster. Spend 50, get 10, and Spend 40, get 9 paper booster. So this might be free or even money maker for me. Total for this transaction is $53.69. So yes, I able to use my Spend 50 get $10 of Walgreens cash digital booster together with spend 40 get $9 of Walgreens cash paper booster. I have a total of $21 between my digital coupon and also paper coupon and I have a lot of register reward that I'm going to roll in this transaction to lower my out of pocket. Let me show you my receipt for this transaction. As you can see, that's the Oral-B $3, Crest $3, 2 bit $10.86, the Gain $9.99, the other bit $5.19, the Userin $9.49, and the Tunivia $17.58. The Tunivia $8.79, and my 20% discount deducted $3.52. For the Nivea and one dollar and ninety cents for the Userin. I use a point booster of spend forty get nine dollars Walgreens cash and the twenty percent discount deducted a total of five dollars and forty two cents. I use two three dollars for the big. $3 for the Userin and $2 for the Nivea. All my digital came out also four dollars for the big. $2 for the gain, $1 for the Crest, and $1 for the Oral-B. I rolled a total of $24 extra box, $25, $24, two $4, and $3 for a total of $24 register reward. My out-of-pocket is $8.69, so I use my PayPal debit card for that transaction. But then I receive a total of $32.53 of Walgreens cash. So I receive $10 of Walgreens cash for spending $20 on the Nivea and Userin, 
$10 Walgreens cash for spending $50 on my digital booster and $9 Walgreens cash for spending $40 on my paper booster and the $3 of Walgreens cash for buying three of the big. The 53 cents, that's everyday points. I also received the $3 register reward for buying three of the big. So yes, it's still double dipping the big. I also received the $5 PNG register reward for spending 15 on the game as well as the RLB and Crest and also the $4 register reward for buying the Crest and the RLB. So I pay a total of $32.69 for that transaction, $24 register reward and $8.69 out of pocket. But then I receive a total of $44.53 back, making it completely free and $11.84 moneymaker. Yes guys, almost $12 moneymaker for that transaction. Then I did the gain and Oral-B and Crest deal again because it's really good. I grabbed the gain, $9.99. We have $2 digital. One of the Crest, uh, $3. We have $1 digital. And one of the Oral-B, $3. We have $1 digital. I'm trying to roll this $5 PNG register reward as well as this $4 register reward that I received from my first transaction. But for some reason, it was rejected by the system. I don't know what happened because on Sunday haul, I just kept rolling my register reward that I received from my previous transaction to my next transaction and I don't have any issue. But for this one, I don't know, even the cashier tried to put it manually, it's still the system don't allow to you to put the uh, register reward manually. So anyway, I just pay using my PayPal debit card for that transaction because I'm using also spend 15, get $5 a Walgreens cash a paper booster. Let me show you my receipt. As you can see, that's the gain $9.99, the Crest $3 and the Oral B $3. So my points booster of spend 15, get 5 $2 digital for the gain and $1 digital for the crest and $1 for the oral B. My total is $11.99, so I just use my PayPal debit card. But then I received the $5 Walgreens cash for spending $15 for my paper booster. I also received the $4 register reward for buying the oral B and crest, so no issue on that. And also it printed me this $5 PNG register reward for spending $15 on PNG products. So I pay $11.99 for that transaction, but then I receive a total of $14 back, making it completely free and $2.01 moneymaker. There's no issue for that. It's still giving the register reward. The only issue is the one for the detergent, buy three, get $5, and also the one for the bounty as well as the charmin. The $3 register reward is no longer printing. So for my last Walgreens haul this week that cost $121.63 so before sale price is completely free and $21.17 moneymaker. Yes guys, $21 moneymaker for this transaction. So if you have spend 50, get 10 as well as paper booster of spend 40, get $9 Walgreens cash. Try to work on it because it's really good if you have a both booster instead of only one booster which is digital. It's better to always pair it with paper booster to make it the deal even better or even a money maker. That's everything I got for you today guys and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to hit the notification down below so you will be notified once I have new video uploaded. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any great deals. Thank you all for watching and see you on the next one.